In this video, we'll compare Coolify against Cloud Panel. So we'll start with Coolify. Coolify is self-hosted, open source, and super flexible. It runs on any server, VPS, Raspberry Pi, EC2, etc. And lets developers deploy apps, static sites, databases, all through Docker containers. Key features here are Git powered deployments from GitHub, GitLab, Bitbucket, or Gitya, as well as automated SSL via Let's Encrypt and reverse proxy setup. Coolify also supports various stacks like Node.js, Python, PHP, Static, plus built in DB support and a backup to S3 compatible storage, as well as real-time terminal team collaboration with roles, resource monitoring, pull request previews, and webhooks. If we're looking at the pricing here, Coolify is completely free with full access to all features. You need your own infrastructure for Coolify though. You have no limitations or restrictions, as well as automated or self-managed updates. Now, if you want to jump over to the cloud, you can pay $5 a month and be able to connect to servers, or you can pay $4 a month with the annual payment fee. Then we jump over to Cloud Panel. Cloud Panel is a sleek, free control panel tailored for managing websites and apps. It's not a full PAAS, but is laser focused on web hosting with speed and clarity. Key features here are the minimalistic dashboard, so you can monitor server metrics like CPU, RAM, and disk, auto SSL, role-based access, firewall, and Redis pre-enabled. It also supports Debian and Ubuntu with low resource requirements of 2 gigs RAM and 10 gig disk space. It works on cloud providers like AWS, DigitalOcean, Hetzner, and so forth, and includes PHP MyAdmin, auto login, logs, performance optimizations, and backup options. So which one should you choose? Choose Coolify if you're managing multiple apps and want Git deploy workflows, Docker automation, SSL magic, and full control on your own servers. Choose Cloud Panel if you're a solo admin focused on efficient, secure, lightweight web hosting with a beautiful, easy interface. Let me know in the comments section which route you're leaning towards. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.